Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel. So we're just gonna jump straight into the tutorial today. I'm already washing my hair with the Main Choice Ancient Egyptian Shampoo, and then I'm gonna follow up with the Ancient Egyptian Anti-Breakage and Repair Hair Mask. This is definitely one of my favorite deep conditioners, and it is way too easy to detangle with this stuff. After rinsing my hair, I'm gonna split it into four sections and then I'm gonna split those sections in half so that I have eight all together. And then I'm gonna apply some leave-in and some ancient Egyptian oil. And then we are going to try the new 24 karat glistening gold twisting gel. Guys, this stuff is so golden. I was ready to give y'all some swatches like this was a highlight. Ooh, this slip. So I'm applying the twisting gel from roots to ends and because it has such awesome slip, I definitely did not need a lot at all. I used about enough to cover two fingertips. So once I apply the gel, I'm gonna two strand twist my hair halfway. I'm not twisting all the way to the ends, I'm only gonna go halfway. So for the other half of my hair, I'm going to apply some of the Ancient Egyptian Split End Serum and I'm going to work that in. And then I'm going to take my flexi rods, which are also from the main choice. I'm going to take these flexi rods and coil the ends of my hair onto the rod. And this is how it looks once I'm done. All right, moving on to the front, I'm gonna split this section in half and then apply some leave-in and ancient Egyptian oil. And then I'm gonna apply the twisting gel. And do you guys see this definition? Can we just take a moment for the definition? I need to try this on a wash and go next. But in the meantime, we're gonna stick with these twists. So remember, I'm two strand twisting my hair halfway. I'm not going all the way down to the ends. And then the rest of the hair that's out on the ends, I'm gonna apply some of the split end serum and then I'm gonna coil my ends onto the flexi rod main choice. I mean, the main choice flexi rod. <laughs> I'm also making sure that I'm smoothing the ends on the flexi rod just so that I don't have any flyaways. And then I'm gonna twist it one time and close the rod. For you dolls who are familiar with my channel, you know that I reviewed the Ancient Egyptian line when it first came out and I absolutely loved it. And the only thing about it that I said was that I wish it was a styler. That was the only thing that they were missing from the collection, a good old styler. And now look, here we are a couple months later using the new styler and I am loving it so far. It's available now at select Sally Beauty locations and themainchoice.com and it's water-based. I love a good water-based gel because I notice that I don't get crunch or flakes. Besides being water-based, it's also made with some of my favorite oils like castor and avocado oil. This is how it looks once I'm done. I have eight twists in total and I'm gonna let this air dry overnight. All right, so these are ready for takedown. I'm just gonna unravel each rod and then I'm gonna coat my hands with some oil and begin to separate and fluff my curls. The great thing that I noticed about this gel as soon as I took out my first twist was how it didn't give me a gel cast. It honestly doesn't even feel like I used a gel at all. So I really do think it's just that moisturizing where it doesn't give you a gel cast, it doesn't give you crunch, but it does give you that same definition that a gel would. So I'm gonna continue taking each twist out and coiling the ends around my finger just to make sure that I keep that definition on the curl. Besides using a really good moisturizing products for any of your sets, how you actually separate and twist your curls is really important for how the style is gonna come out. So you see here, I ended up twisting the curl in the wrong direction and it just got bunched up and wouldn't move. But then I twisted the hair in the right direction and the coil laid really nicely. It's also really important to separate your hair where it naturally wants to separate so that you avoid frizz. Mm -hmm. 
So now that my curls are separated, I'm gonna go ahead and section off the top half of my hair and start to pick. I'm sectioning that off because you don't really see the bottom. Whenever you look at your hair, you see the front and the top of your hair first. So we don't wanna disturb those curls and we don't wanna create any unnecessary frizz. So I'm actually just gonna pick it about three times and then I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side. Section off the top half, pick the bottom, and then pick the top lightly, only about three to four times. If I notice frizz anywhere, I'm just gonna take a little bit of the ancient Egyptian oil and coil the ends and they pop right back into place. I'm loving how defined my hair is and how full it is on day one. To finish this look off, I'm gonna take the Main Choice Laid Back Effortlessly Growth Stimulating Edge Control and apply that directly to my edges. Then I'm gonna take this brow brush to lay my edges. The teeth on this are really fine, so it just makes it really easy to lay my edges with this. This little brush really does make such a difference for me. I know some of us like rat tail combs or toothbrushes. Comment below and let me know what you dolls use to lay your edges. And that's it, here's the final look. I absolutely love the way my hair came out. I've tried twists and curls before and they were all fails, so I'm happy that I was able to achieve a successful twist and curl using the new Main Choice 24 Karat Glistening Gold Twisting Gel. I hope you dolls liked this video. If you did, make sure you comment, like, and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next upload. Bye, guys.